Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting during two episodes 9 and 10 of Simfinger XD. I was a little lazy today. I was supposed to do this. This is officially now like 6 o'clock in the evening. I was supposed to do this at like 2, 3 o'clock, but no, something happened. Today has been a really good day for me. Because New Kingdom Hearts, it's just come out today and I've been super duper excited about it and stuff like that. If you follow me on Twitter, it's all on Twitter and ish and everything. But, I, like I said, I was supposed to get this done and I was super duper lazy and I was like, you know what, I'm going to stop bullshit and I want to get this done. I was supposed to do two shows, two Patreon shows today, but I'm just going to do one. I'm not ready to personally see Hibiki and Miku duke it out i think it's this might be an emotional episode this might be even more emotional than this week's fruits basket for me maybe i don't really know i'm not gonna know until i start watching the damn episode but other than that let's go ahead and get started with episode nine and three two one go girlfriend no <laughs> See, why is she talking? Oh my god, me, Hibiki, Hibiki, you cannot, <laughs> Ali, you, you can't start like that. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. You cannot say on that day because you're basically kind of telling me that this child has fucking died. I mean, mm -mm. okay, so basically, this is how this show ends. You know, Hibiki loses Miku. She, you know, she changes her name to Futaba Sakura. She lives at a cafe with, you know, Sojiro, Sojiro, or is it Sakura? She becomes a hermit. And so the personified protagonist comes in and changes her world. And then she's happy again. Mm -hmm. That's what happens. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Wrap that in a nice neat little bow. That's it. That's the end of the series, guys. I'm so happy I watched this series. I enjoyed it so freaking much. I'm just kidding, though. But it would be really funny if it ended like that, even though I don't think it's gonna happen. <laughs> but why the fuck would you say that? Like, you were literally in my mind right now telling me that it's a possibility that this adorable your freaking waifu your girlfriend is dead that's worse than mp5 when we're all playing the game and it looks like ryuji died and freaking on is like over here freaking the f out and i'm just over here i'm like oh my god Ryuji's fucking dead. And then a couple minutes later, Ryuji wasn't dead. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my god. But, mm, don't Don't do that to me. Mm -mm. What the hell? Um. I think y'all know what I'm gonna ask, so uh, I'm not even gonna ask it. The comments will probably tell you. Well, you know, hmm, why don't we start from the beginning? <laughs> Jesus. 
she should have died from that. I'm just saying, but you know, hey, this is an anime. Gotta really die, ain't me go. <laughs> Damn it, on. <laughs> oh I told you. I told you that was gonna happen. Oh, oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? Oh, of course she is, but her fucking grandma. <laughs> That they just call you then. We're talking about the people at the beginning of the first episode of this season. Nope. Nope. Big. But. No. Jesus Christ, this everybody in the situations that they have to deal with is like, is this the right twist? Is this the wrong twist? Are we really, is this something good that I should do? And I'm over here. <laughs> this is worse than Dr. Maroki and his shit. Oh my God. That's another Prashana reference. Be sure of you. <laughs> I don't want water anymore. I want alcohol. And plus, Maria can't kill her girlfriend. Well, yeah, what do you say to your daughter about a situation like this? How do you even... <laughs> mm. 
No, no, no. You're not cursed, babe. Now, see, are we just coming here to talk, or are we going to talk and then kill? I mean, seriously, let's just go ahead and kill the grandfather. Do not kill the best girl, Subasa. Mm -mm. Nope. But if you have to. If you have to. Oh. Okay, never mind. It seems a little too easy. Tuasa. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know what you oh my god. This isn't right though. Oh my god, this girl with the fuck? <laughs> Shit, remember your bonds with your friends or something? I don't know. Oh my god. See, that's not really Subasa. Subasa talking. That's Subasa under the influence talking. And see, I can't. I can't. This is too much. Like, this hurts. Oh. <laughs> Hell, we fuck her girlfriend. I'm fucking her girlfriend. Oh my god. I can't right now. I can't watch the rest of this episode. It fucking hurt. Um, Grandpa, 
what the fuck? You been in the gym? Like, I, I mean... This is too much. This is way too much. I still can't believe these are so alive. I thought they would be dead by now. Yeah, but what are you going to have me go to? I just spoke way too fucking soon. Um, well, um, damn. <laughs> don't go with him. Do not go with him. Please don't go with him. <laughs> Stand up for yourself, please. This season is so fucking dark, I can't. It's go go and kill her grandpa. And it doesn't be on me. I'm like, yeah, that's my baby. <laughs> okay, we're here. This is too much. This is only the first episode of the Oh my god. I would want Maria to kind of wake the fuck up to help her girlfriend, but it's something that she has to do on her own. Yeah, she really butted her head like, oh my god. Oh my god. 
Damn it, Commander, out of all the times. Yeah, Maria, yeah, wake up. How you doing, babe? Mm -hmm. Oh, God. What the hell was this episode? This is too much. Like, oh my god. Fuck your house arrest. Like, go. No, gotta go save my girlfriend. Oh my god, I'm dead. I can't, like, oh god. I thought I wasn't gonna cry in this episode, but. <laughs> oh. See, I feel like what he's saying, it, it's something's gonna happen with these last, like, <clears throat> four episodes? Maybe? See, honestly, I thought he, he was going to be not really out of commission, but like depressed for two episodes straight, and then the final three episodes were her officially like coming into her own again. Literally, like, yep, mm -hmm, let's go, let's do this. I don't know, I'm so happy. Tsubasa, what the fuck? I can't. This, I mean, everything that she's gone through. This episode literally ended. Everything, like her pain, her suffering, oh my god, her happiness, everything that she's gone through for this entire damn series, like that climax going against her grandfather, technically almost killing her grandfather would have been nice, but I'm just saying, I get the fact that Commander had to come in and stop because if she did what she did, there was no way in hell she was going to be able to come back and be normal again. I mean, was I expecting someone to die today? No. Coming into this episode, no. I was expecting it to be, yes, dark, but not to the point that Tsubasa's father would have died. You didn't have to do that to me, but you did it anyway. I mean, oh my god. Like, why did you do that? Like, seriously. Oh my god. Hearing her, like, hold on. Isn't this the thing that we saw in episode one? What the hell? Okay. I'm just gonna... We're gonna take that, and that's probably not even gonna be mentioned again until the last three episodes. But 
I literally, this whole episode, you have to applaud Nana Mizuki for the shit that she does for the show. I mean, but oof, this episode. This woman's range. Like, oh my god. Because I, I can't. Her just screaming. Like, oh my god. Like, seriously, if you have not played Persona 5 or Persona 5 R, go play that. Play it strictly in Japanese just to hear the, you know, the VAs. It's like, oh. Because when she screamed, like, father, I cried over father. I just get reminded how she, like, so upset she was over fucking Ryuji. Like, supposedly dying. And I'm just over here like, oh my god. Like, mm. But Jesus Christ, like, honestly, she needs an award for this show. She didn't get any awards for this show. Any of the songs that she did for this show, did she get anything? Because if not, I mean, give her everything. I mean, you know, 10 out of 10, woman. Like, oh my God, this was just a really good episode for Subasa to end her arc. I mean, yes, we got a couple more episodes left before the series is over, but specifically for her. It's like she's done. She's still going to get more character development in these last four episodes. But her arc, what she is as a character, who she is as a character, it's just like, mm. nice little neat bow. Send it off. Good vibe. And like, oh, God, I, this might have to be my favorite episode. Like, oh, because, oh, but I mean, now what the fuck is going to happen? What I mean, oh, can we just talk about the fact that those three got killed by Miku? Like, oh my god, I wasn't expecting it. I mean, it's so funny how, like, mm, yeah, I thought they were going to be dead by now. Two seconds later, they died. Oh my god, I was thinking, like, maybe if they didn't die in this episode, they would have maybe either died in the following next episodes or they would have survived. But really, in the case of bad guys, for no matter what type of show it is, they always usually die in the end. Um, I hope that by the time the show ends, with the last remaining week, well, for me, it'll be two. Yeah, two. Mm, two weeks. Um, or really, more than a week, really. Um, between this week's and next week's episodes, when I watch this next one and going into the next week. Please, for the love of Christ, like, I swear to you, please, just get some handcuffs. Put the handcuffs on Tsubasa's grandfather. Lock that motherfucker up. Don't let him escape anything. This is, mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm. Just go. Like, that's it. Mm -mm. I don't need him to come back. It's the last season of this damn show, and I swear to God. If in 11, 12, and 13, he pops up in some weird shape or form and is like, mm -hmm, no, I'm still going to be the bad guy of this final season. I swear to God, like, no, please don't do me like that. I mean, I really hate this guy. I really, really do. He had no, he had no fucking right to kill, to almost kill this girl. And then it was like sweet that her father who she sees as a father figure came and saved her, but still at the same time, he fucking dies. And he has no remorse for killing his fucking son. I mean, if it's like that, like, right then and there, he should have died. I'm sorry, because, I mean, if you don't feel remorse about your child, especially whether you either killed them or not, goodbye, like, mm. Deuces, like, mm -mm, not in my book. Like, oh, you are, you are worse, <laughs> worse than like any human being, any anime character, and you're disgusting and you're scum, and I hate you, and I want you to just die. That's it. Like, if anybody says that <laughs> that their favorite character is the grandfather, mm, I, I, you got some trust issues. <laughs> I don't know if I can trust you with this situation with anything but like mm, that's just me but Jesus Christ this was a damn good episode and honestly I cannot wait to see what in the world is gonna happen in episode 10 hopefully he can make it in time we don't know if we're gonna watch it in one second but yeah go ahead and pause the video and I'll see you guys in one second for episode 10 okay episode 10 in three two one go Mm. 
<laughs> no, it's in three girls who just died. And, and, yeah. Mm. What the fuck? Miku? Miku. Really, she's talking about grandfather right there. I have, I wouldn't be mad if she killed him. I'm just saying. Well, shit. We screwed, right? You're not going to cut her arm off. Hmm? Didn't you just stop? I can't. I can't. Oh. But she just killed these bitches. Hello. I can't. What the fuck is going on? Jesus Christ, we're only like a couple of minutes into the damn episode. I don't know anymore. Oh my god, this is like Final Secret Boss. <laughs> this is like, oh my god. I mean, yeah, this is like Final Secret Boss time, or literally the final boss of like any game. For some five hours. Not the twin, or like um, Jose. This <laughs> is like no, 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 no. I know what it is. I know what it is. I know what it is. <laughs> I haven't played it in the DLC for P Five R, but it's when you go against the previous two <laughs> protagonists for Persona Four, Persona Three, and I'm just like, oh god, we're gonna die. Like, oh my god, mm -mm. this is. That, you know what? No. This is Yazora from Kingdom Hearts 3. This is like the data version of Organization 13, which your girl still has not defeated those people. I've defeated like two, three out of the 13, and I've seen the Yazora battle billions of times, and I'm like, I don't think I'll be able to get that. 
I mean, I'm good at the game, but I ain't that good. <laughs> I'm not like, mm, yeah, I can kill somebody with some style. I'm over here like, <laughs> you know, like, I'm in danger. That's me. That is me. And I, we're in danger right now because what the freak is that? Oh, my God. What was that? Oh, okay. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. See? You did the same. Thank you. Thank you for doing this. Good job. <sighs> Thank God. I had like a little bit of hope that he would have been okay, but still. Yeah, how are we going to deal with that situation about Miku? We're going to kill Miku? I don't want that, but you know, I do what you gotta do. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. I can't. My heart. Like, Oh my god. <laughs> so how the hell are we gonna kill this woman? How are, how are we gonna kill Miku? How are we gonna separate Miku from this bit? Like I'm so scared. I don't think he think he can do this. Yeah, y'all was killed. Y'all was killed. There was a whole bunch of blood. Lost August. She Well, y'all screwed. I, I will cry about that too.
shit. Couldn't be me. I'd rather die. <laughs> I know what was it like. Mm, so that's what that was in the last episode. Okay. Well, wouldn't it be better for them to go? I've heard... I don't wait, wait, wait. Hold on, was the name of the game an o overlord name, like, that name with the Y? Because I've heard that name before, and I, I know that's random to say, but I'm like... I'm <laughs> I'm I swear to God if it is. <laughs> Right. <clears throat> Excuse me.
you know, you are such a nuisance. I mean, mm, I love you though, but oh god, I need y'all to go. Like, <laughs> I mean, but seriously, do y'all really care? Because see, if they die. They're dead. That's it. They're not going to be able to be human again. And it's like, mm, is it really that worth it to you guys? Like, everything. Mm -mm. Like they have gone like, too far gone to the point where yeah you can't get them back so um it is what it is Behind you? Mm -hmm. Behind you. I mean, you know they could just make get another rocket, right? So, unless, you know, there's nothing else they really can do. You only got, like, a backup plan or, like, a backup rocket just in case. Because, yeah, y'all are, like, totally fucked. We got five minutes left. Oh my god. <laughs>
Oh, that's it. There is no way in hell she's coming back from that. That's one. Mm hmm. Oh my god, child, no. Please hurry. Okay, thank God. Persona 5 right there. Persona 5. Mementos right there. Go play the game. I'm sorry. Like that if that is not a reference or an issue to Persona 5 when everybody disappeared, like I don't know what that is. I mean, you know, it just could be a coincidence. Like, you know, I don't think it's really a reference, but still. <sighs> we got three episodes left. I don't know how I feel anymore. I I'm like I'm sad. Was that a cliffhanger? Kind of. But oof. Oh my god. Three episodes left. Where the heck did they go? They could literally be anywhere. They could be on the moon right now. Who knows? I don't know until like maybe Sunday, depending on how, if I don't have that much to do on Sunday. Um, but this episode was good. Like, oh, I mean. Mm. To start with, you know, finding out that they <laughs> didn't die. Technically, yes, they did die, but then they came back to life, which is interesting because she saved them ish. I'm still wondering how in the world we're going to defeat Shemha. They oh okay, never mind. Hold on. That's what I wanna know. What are you looking at? <laughs> they are literally ending the series with them fighting in space. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. This is gonna be so much better. I already know it is. It's gonna be better than the darling and the friend that we got. <laughs> Cause I mean, everybody knows how much a shit show Darling was. Well, the second half more or less, not the first half. The first half of Darling was really good, but you know mm, that second half. <laughs> I mean I don't know. I mean, I would have to go back and look at, like, the, the freaking battle in space in Darling and then kind of compare it to this one. But we already know this is going to be so freaking good. I, I'm going to be just a proud mama of all these girls kicking ass. And it's just going to be so good. But, I, I mean, if it is with these last three episodes, holy shit. I mean, of course, it makes sense to be in space because if they're not anywhere on the planet, where is it they're going to be if you can't find them anywhere? I mean, would their detections even work in space? Like, I, it should. I, I don't know. Elf's going to come up with something. I mean, come on. That's my child. She has to come up with something to find these girls. Or, I don't know. 
then there's no way for them. There's got to be a way for them to come back home. There's got to be a way for them to communicate with everyone else. I don't know. We got three episodes left and my heart can't take it anymore. <laughs> I'm not ready for these last three episodes. I mean, they're the last three episodes of this beautiful, amazing show. And I really don't want it to end because when it comes and whenever, whatever day I record it, it's just going to feel more real. Um, yeah, I'm not ready for that. I'm not ready to say, you know, that is my reaction to the entire series of it. But it's it's just going to be really, really heartbreaking on Sunday or Monday or Tuesday, whenever the hell I record the last three. But, like, ooh, this episode. These last two episodes were just damn dear. <sighs> Top tier as fuck. I mean, and whatever in the world happens in these last three episodes they're gonna be good i just i want a happy ending i want miku to be okay i don't want miku to die i want her and hibiki to just be able to be together and spend the rest of their lives together whether it is as a guy dang couple or just as friends or whatever maybe in the last episode hibiki will finally you know acknowledge her feelings I don't know. I mean, it could literally be anything, but I am scared. I am nervous. I am like all the letters in the alphabet right now about what could happen. And honestly, I can't wait. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to you towards episodes 9 and 10 of Simfigure XV. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Magic Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Friday for Patreons and next Thursday for everybody else for the final three episodes. Bye, guys.